Hey folks, thanks for joining me today. So I saw these little guys on uh, Pinterest and I thought, what a great idea to use my little half circles that I make with my leftover UltraCal 30 when I'm making my bigger stones. I always end up having a little bit left over and I just pour it into a paint tray and I let them dry and they come out in these beautiful little half circles. Um, I use them, I did a tutorial before and I showed you how I made pocket hugs with these guys. Um, but now I'm going to make little tiny love bugs. Like they're so cute. So I did two base or two coats of white on the rock before I went in with any color. Um, and now I'm doing uh, the head and then I'm going to be doing some stripes. You can do as many or as little stripes as you want. You can make them thin, you can make them thick whatever you want. You don't even have to use black. Use whatever color you want. Um, these were so fun and easy to do, quick, and they're adorable. Like, I'm so in love with these. I think I'm going to do a whole whack of more of these because it's just, can you hear it in my voice? I'm like really excited about these guys. They're so cute and so easy to make. So um, I went in and I uh, did some stripes uh, with black paint. Um, I do fix them up just to make them a little bit more uh, thicker, uh, but like I said, you can put as many or as few as you want. You can make them uh, thin, you could make them thick, uh, whatever you want. Like Your imagination is your limitation, so you do what you want to do. Um, I was just really excited to show these to you and how easy they are to make and so much fun to do. Um, you don't even have to use UltraCal 30. If you have a paint tray, uh, you can certainly do this um, and you can use uh, like Plaster of Paris, be something fun to do as an activity with the children, um, just whatever you want. To make the eyes, what I'm using are my tools from the Dotting Center. Um, if you're interested, there is a link in the description below to her shop and you can use my discount code to get 10% off if you want to get your own set of tools. Um, I love them. They're great. I've used them for just about everything I can think of. So I put the eyes on with those tools. Then I go to my dotting stylist and I'm putting the heart on his back or her back. Um, so I'm just putting two big blobs of, of paint on there as big dots and then I simply drag the dots down to meet each other at a point and then using the same stylist I paint with it so I just fill in the heart and there it is it's a perfect little cute little heart on the back of this little love bug so to finish it off I go and use a much smaller stylist and put a little bit of white paint on it and add it in to make it look like it's looking at you. And then I add a little gleam, like a shine on the heart. So uh, basically I'm dragging the dot. So I put a dot on there and then I added more paint so that I could drag it. And I just followed the curve of the heart. Look at that guy, isn't he so cute? So here's the stages, one, two, three, four, five and six and there you have it folks life is what you make it so get creative mm -hmm. 